Hey guys. Hey, how you doing out there? You blessed? Are you healed? Are you free? Are you saved? Ooh, my dear <laughs> brothers and sisters in Christ. I hope you're saved out there. Hallelujah. I truly do. That's my heart, Deanna's heart. Yes. It's that's also God's it's heart. God's heart. <laughs> Amen. Most certainly is. And that's all he's ever wanted was to have a relationship with you. And I'm talking to you right now. Somebody out there just... Uh, are, are you scrolling in or whatever? Listen, dial in right here. I want you to just listen up and, and listen to Deanna and I. We have a word we want to share with you. And if you don't know Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior, then we can walk you through a prayer afterwards if your heart is ready to receive. Amen. And uh, we're gonna, uh, we have a word. I'm going to sing a song. And uh, let's just love to get to know you too, honestly. And just, it's awesome you're watching. Uh, all you, uh, all you listeners out there, praise God. And the tree trimmers, I heard are listening. That's oh, awesome. Yeah. Praise God. That's awesome, Steve. <laughs> yeah. The one guy, one guy called me Steve Olstein. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever, dude. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> praise God. Listen, but we love, we love you all, and yes. we're here for you. And uh, uh, at the end of this, uh, yes, and once again, I'm going to say it. We'll walk you through a prayer. There will be a, a, a church number for the church and uh, a website for you to visit if you want to. Amen. Okay. Come check us out. Why not? That's right. We're going to start with, what are we going to talk about today, my love? Well, today it's uh, we're going to read scriptures out of Hebrews 13, chapter 13, verses 10 through 15. And, and this talks about how we can, are we, we're to continue to offer praise to God. Yes. Do you want to read that? I got it right here. Cool. Please. Uh, oh, okay. Sorry. Starting with verse 10. I had it. Verse okay. 10. We have an altar from which the priest in the tabernacle have no right to eat. Under the old system, the high priest brought the blood of animals to the holy place as a sacrifice for sin, and the bodies of the animals were burned outside the camp. Also, so also Jesus suffered and died outside the city gates to make his people holy by means of his own blood. Praise God. I thank you, Jesus, for your blood. Amen. So let us go out to him outside the camp and bear the disgrace he bore. For this world is not our permanent home. Aren't you glad this this place Amen. is not our permanent home? That's right. Hallelujah. We, but we are looking forward to a home yet to come. Verse 15. Therefore, let us offer through Jesus... A continual sacrifice of praise to God, proclaiming our allegiance to his name. We thank you, Father God, for your word. We thank yes. you, Father God, that as we share the, your word, Father God, that your presence and your, and your, and your anointing be on it. If, in, in Jesus' name, amen. Amen. Got mosquitoes flying around me. <laughs> so, praising God is a sacrifice, people of God. And the Greek word is is I can't pronounce it is T-H-E-S-I-A and it means this it means to kill or slaughter for a purpose so praise often now listen to me people of God this is really cool praise often requires that we kill our pride come on our fear yes. or anything else that that threatens to diminish or interfere with our praise to our God you know that the world that we live in Deanna there's a lot of things that can come into play right oh, there. Oh, how about disappointment? Yes. Disappointment, um, despair. Yes, all these things that yeah. the world offers you and it is trying to get you away from praising God. We are to focus on praising yes. the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. That should be our ultimate Continual. focus. Continually. That's Amen. right, Steve. Listen, we, we, we'll, uh, we also know that uh, that the basis of our praise, the sacrifice, is a sacrifice to our God. Amen. To our Lord Jesus Christ. That as we uh, as we begin to praise and we worship Him, we, we are sacrificing our own life to Him. That's right. Amen. Amen. It is by Him, in Him, with Him, to Him, and for Him. Yes. <laughs> that we offer our sacrifice of praise to God. Yes. Praise God. Amen. That's awesome. Thank you, Lord. All right, so we look at our praise. It will never be hindered. It will never be hindered when we keep our focus on Him, who is the founder and the finisher of our faith. Amen. The Steve. founder and the, the finisher, finisher of, of our, our salvation. It's His cross. It's His blood. Yes. His gift of love. Thank you. 
uh, or his love gift of life and forgiveness mm -hmm. to us. So let's keep praise as a living sacrifice, yes. people of God. Our altar is the cross of Christ. Yes. We must not trust in our old ritual ideas or ways. Those who do, they are excluded from the saving benefits of God's death, of Jesus Christ's death. So those who put their trust in other things other than God. That's right. You will be excluded. That's right. Wow. Yes. Wow, that's awesome. Yes. I mean, it's not awesome, but I mean, it's good to know. That's, that's good right. information. It's awesome to know that, that, that's a, that, 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 you, that, that you get an understanding of yes, that. Yes, absolutely. That's right. Amen. Keeping your eyes fixed on Jesus and Him alone. And uh, with continual praise on your lips. Yes. How can the world get you down if you're praising God? It can't. That's right. All right? Amen. That's right. Amen, Steve. Listen, if you, uh, if you don't know Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior, and listen, if your heart is ready, if you want to, all right, I'll walk you through a prayer. If your heart is ready, and just say, Father God, I come to you now. I know I have sin in my life, but I want to change. I know that I need Jesus to be my Savior. I believe that he died on the cross, and I believe that he rose from the dead for the forgiveness of my sins and so that I can have eternal life with him. I thank you, Jesus, for saving me. Amen. Amen. If you just prayed that prayer. Praise, praise God. Praise God. There. Listen, and you meant it? They are celebrating in heaven. And I'm we're going to celebrate you. with you. Yes. Amen. Yep. That's awesome. And just like I said before, listen, contact our church, which is Resurrection Life Church, St. Louis, Michigan. And 10 a.m. Sunday mornings is our service. Yes. Our website number will be at the bottom of the screen. Yes. Contact Amen. us. That's right. Come and visit us. Yes. We'd love to see you there. Amen. Amen. I have, yes. a, I have a song I'd like to share with you. Oh, I just want to say this. If you don't live around close to us, Come on. you can contact us anyway. We will help you find a good church. There's right lots of them. In your area. That's right. Excuse me. Okay, you ready, Steve? I'm ready. Who am I? <laughs> I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to change keys, lovey. Okay. <laughs> He brought me in Oh, His love for me Oh, His love for me When the sun sets free He is free indeed I'm a child of God Yes, I am In my Father child of God yes I am hallelujah listen that's that should be how you start your day every morning get up and just begin to praise God throw in a throw in a wow I was gonna say CD turn on the radio listen turn, put it stick in your earbuds and listen to some praise and worship music and let that set the pace for you today amen Steve. amen that's right we love you we yes. call you blessed and we will see you on Friday. Yes. Peace. Peace.